Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. My name is Devin and today I'm going to talk about a transgender identity card. A few weeks ago I met up with a friend who also happens to be transgender. We were sitting in a pub and he was talking about a transgender identity card that could help you get through customs or even just get into a pub when the picture and your name on your ID card doesn't match your name and your face right now. So I was curious and I was like, alright, that sounds good, let me order one. So I went on to this website called Transvisi. It's a company based in the Netherlands and it will send you an ID card with your own information on it, but with your preferred picture and your preferred name. So I have to say that this ID card doesn't serve like an official ID card. It's just a card that you can hold next to your card saying this is the reason I didn't look like my picture and this is the reason my name is different. Over the last couple of years the transgender identity card has been used so much in the Netherlands that even the customs and some clubs and pubs are aware of the transgender identity card and they know the meaning and they know how to use it. So it's really easy for people who are transgender to show that ID card, show the trans ID card and people just go like ah that's the reason. So obviously, after hearing about transgender identity cards, I really wanted to have one. So I went on to that website and there were a few different documents that you could order there because the company isn't only to order a transgender identity card. There are things like a general brochure, both in Dutch and English. There is a brochure about activities that Transvisie is holding for transgender people. There is the gender identity card. There is a a little magazine from Vicky that is all about transgenders and there are the books Hooray it's a person and gender dysphoria in school. So I ordered my transgender identity card and they sent me this letter. They send you this and they go like alright you've ordered this and maybe you've ordered something else. This is so much, this is so much and then you can pay for it. After I paid Transfizi the money, a few days later another letter arrived at my door. This time it was actually the gender identity card. So they sent me this letter wishing me a lot of luck and a lot of happiness with my new GID card. And in the back, there it goes. Technically the gender identity card isn't as a professional card as your identity card itself. But it does maintain all the information that you need. This is my gender identity card. It has your preferred name, your old name, your date of birth and your personal number, which I'm blocking out because it's my personal number. <laughs> so on the back it says, a transgender person can both have traits of male and female. And the picture on this card can be different than the picture on the actual ID card. So in general, I have to say I'm really, really pleased with especially the idea of a transgender identity card. Although they should have made it a bit better, in my opinion. Um, it's just a piece of paper and then laminated, which isn't a bad thing at all, but I would rather have gotten a PVC kind of plastic pass, uh, just like your identity card. Uh, I would even be willingly to pay a little bit more for this. This was just seven euros. With that, I do really, really enjoy the idea of this and the idea that is also kind of known in the Netherlands is really nice for me. So yes, I would definitely recommend a gender identity card. And with that, that's all I have for you guys today. Please give a like, subscribe and comment down below if you'd like to know anything or if you have a question or whatever. And I'll see you guys again next Sunday. Leaders!